know at times it can feel like your heart's under assault. The distance in your marriage, the chasm between the paycheck and the bills, the suffocating fear of the future, or sometimes the lingering shame of the past. Sometimes they can weigh so heavy that our heart can barely breathe, let alone live with the freedom and abundant life it was created for. So it's important that we guard and protect the treasure of our heart. Proverbs 4.23 says, above all else, meaning more than anything, guard your heart, for it affects everything you do. I know this personally because I lived for years with an unguarded and protected heart, and because of that, the enemy wreaked havoc on my heart. He stole my joy, my peace. I lived wrapped in fear until one day I discovered the treasure of my heart. Reclaiming Hearts Ministries was birthed because of this journey. Now we count it a privilege to walk with you and yours, whether it's reclaiming your heart and bringing it back to life or learning how to guard and protect it. We do this by taking the truth of God's Word, who gave us His heart in Jesus for the freedom of ours. And we have gotten to watch people take courageous journeys in bringing their heart back to life. I used to think I had to perform for others to feel valued, but now I understand that true value is in just being real. I lived for years with a controlling heart, and every day the Lord is teaching me how to live with a releasing heart. There have been seasons in my life when I've really had an angry heart. My anger made me honest, and I found God to be loving and caring, and my heart was reconciled to Him. Fear used to keep my heart captive, but as I've learned to rely on God, He's brought me to a place of freedom. I know what it is to live with a disappointed heart. Each day I continue on the journey to move from disappointment to rejoicing during my difficult moments. I've spent years feeling like I was bottled up in shame, but now the Lord is teaching me how to live with a reclaimed heart. These are people just like you, people who decided that their heart was worth fighting for. And because of that, they've seen marriages restored, they've seen growth in businesses. Some have felt the lingering shame of their past wash away. Others have had vision for their future, and some have discovered the God of the details of their story. Friends, this culture would try to convince us that the solution to our problems is going to be found in the next political party or in the money in our bank account or in our measured success, our education, or our ability to be relevant. But this is a lie from the enemy. The answer to this culture, to your family, to your future, has and always will be about the condition of your heart. That's why we want to fight with you. So join us at a weekend experience or utilize the resources we've created with your heart in mind. Why? Because your heart is so worth it.